How y'all doing? This video might actually get my YouTube channel shut down because it makes too much fucking sense. So here we go. How do you keep your sons safe from whorish women? It's kind of a silly question because you're like, what do you mean? Whorish women? What are you talking about? Don't you know the Me Too movement and all that shit? That Me Too movement. You don't hear about that shit anymore, do you? I just swept that under her fucking rug and Me Too movement. I mean, and you know, these men, they're, 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 they're bad. But let's talk about this a little bit. There's a little skunk that they wanted to ban because of, you know, rape culture. In one of these episodes, since what they won't they will tell you. The reason Peppy the Pew went after the black cat, because she had got a white strap, white stripe of paint down her back. In one of these fucking episodes, if you would if you would watch Peppy the Pew because he's fucking awesome. Peppy the Pew falls in the paint and now he's completely black and he doesn't stink like a skunk anymore. And the black cat turns into a whorish. <laughs> I can say it. She went after him and he ran from her. So, look. All right. The big point I'm trying to make here is. They want to ban Pepe the Pew because of rape culture. Uh, two years ago, uh, It's Cold Outside was banned from the radio because it's rape culture. Rape culture. Rape culture. And the number one song this year is... Da -da 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 Wet Ass Fucking Pussy by Carly B. Now... You can tell yourself, because I picked on my wife about this song, too. I sent it to her a couple times to make fun of her. Said, but if I had young children right now, and they would see me or even listen to this fucking shit. Said, what, are you, what, what are you telling your sons? What are you telling your daughters? I mean, I guess it's okay to be a whore. I just say you had a, you know, an eight-year-old son, and he's hearing you listen to wet ass pussy, and you could be the mom, and you could be the dad, but you're listening to this song, wet ass pussy. To him, I guess it's a, that's what you look for. We look for these fucking hoes. And if you're raising a daughter, you're telling her to be the fucking hoe. I don't know why I'm bringing this up today. I've been thinking about this for a long time. I'm lucky. My daughter's already married. Got a nice husband. My son's already married, got an awesome wife. So I don't have to worry about this shit no more. But think about if you do have to worry about this shit and you got young men. And then, hey, I, 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 even worse yet, what if you have a young daughter and they hear Wet Ass Pussy by Carly B and you smile and think it's an awesome song well I guess we know what you're going to raise you're going to raise a a son that's going to get taken over by one of these whores and pay child support and just some fucking mess or you're going to raise one of these daughters that is a whore that 
gets child support, I guess. Maybe I'm just an asshole, but, uh, yeah. I guess if you don't, I guess if you, did, if you, I guess if you say it's not okay, and you're dancing to it, and you're laughing about it, and you say it's okay, I guess you can't protect your sons from whores. And I guess you can't protect making your daughters whores. God bless, bye.